We got a TV. <laughs> So we're here with uh, Jay Green on November 1st, 2015. Jay, how long have you been coming to Rietta? It's my 35th year uh, setting up here. It's my 30th year on this spot. So tell us, uh, where is Rietta Flea Market located? It's on Route 68 in Hubbardson, Massachusetts, about three miles south of the uh, Route 2 exit for Route 68 in Gardner. So we're kind of in central Worcester County. Some things I have are 100 years old or more, like old postcards and such. Well, postcards, coins, stamps, baseball cards, and they're open at 6, and I usually get here by about 6.30, so I don't want to wait in the line. I have a reserved table. And then in mid-September, they switch over to uh, 7 o'clock opening, and I usually get here about quarter past 7. Okay, George, be good, thank you. Or, boy, that is an old uniform. Hi, I'm J.R. Green. I've been set up here at Rietta Flea Market uh, steadily since 1981. I've been in this spot for 20 years. Dealing old postcards, stamps, and old baseball cards and coins. So, uh, what do you think you'll be doing like 15 years from now on your 50th anniversary of being here? <laughs> well, I might, I would think I might still do it, but I don't think I'd be doing it every Sunday by that point. thing you ever found? Back my house. One of my wife. Well, we were hit, walking around antiquing and I saw her looking at things and then went to her restaurant where she was working and there we were. I'm not married to her anymore. <laughs> That's why I'm back at Rietta. <laughs> looking for another one, huh? No.
smoke in the candle. The other stuff, like you get chasing and then 20 and 20. Yeah, no, 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 no. Well, we're here with Carlos. In my boot, I have clothing and t shirts and some instruments, some jewelry, handmade jewelry. I don't know where he was now. Wow. Where does the jewelry come from?
these shoes has been around since uh, 2008. I milk infuse stained glass jewelry to make my own. Uh, I also have a mermaid's collection where um, if you purchase a mermaid's tear, what it will do is take in the day sunlight and glow lightly in the evening to remind you of a that you are loved by an angel in heaven. These here are are stained, few stained glass, um, which also a lot of my jewelry is um, recycled. Like this was from a wind chime, which I've added my glass to. I know my husband said you should send them out to the schools, and you know, I'm so happy to be on Rihanna TV. Thank you.
Schultz Farm in Rutland, Mass. Those are some of the most gorgeous blueberries I've ever seen. Tell me about them. Well, my father started the farm up in Rutland back in 89. We have cauliflower and broccoli, golden beets, pickling cubes, onions, eggplant, peppers. Um, we also do fresh eggs from the farm and meats here. Yeah, it's all grass-fed, hormone-free, antibiotic-free. My father does all the farm raising of the animals. Um, it's a lot better for you. You don't want things with hormones. The taste is a lot different than what you get at a grocery store.
we do all that. This year, my pizza gone. This year, this year. But, um, I just want to tell you everything. Video, huh?
I love the colorful clothes she wears. I'm picking up good vibrations. Wow! I feel good. I knew that I wouldn't.